have you do the taste test on camera. Oh. I was originally going to do it as an unboxing, but it's hard to do them, like, with the new camera I have. Oh, they're like, uh, cookies. Yeah. What'd you think they were? Well, I saw this, and I was thinking, oh, it's those, like, giant... I thought they were, like, those giant-ass stick cookies. No. These are, like, round cookies. They're, they're Tofalosco biscuits. I'm surprised you couldn't see through the thing. I don't know what that means. Oh. I don't know what a Tofalosco is. Well, would you like to find out? Sure. This time on Legs This play. time on Legs Play. Hardleg and his friends, they're gonna play a lot of games. It's Legs Play. And welcome back to Legs Play, a.k.a. James Tries, I guess. James Food Review. We're reading <laughs> Joe. Joe, go ahead and put the picture up on the screen. We had a super fan, Chris W., came down like a, a couple of weeks back from Hong Kong. And he brought us a bunch of treats. I was originally going to eat them on on a on a like an unboxing, but I got a new camera and the unboxings are different. Ooh, here, let me let me get another picture of these that. They're actually too. like really big too. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna get a picture of these. I was originally gonna open. <laughs> it's it looks... literally like palm sized. Yeah, it's like palm size, and it at least through the camera, it just kind of looks like you're holding a big old turd. Oh yeah, this thing oh, is yeah. a shit brick, and I'm gonna stick it in my mouth yeah, because like, entertainment. Toffle lost this biscuit. How does it go, James? Oh, well, let's see. It's actually not bad. Huh. What's toffee taste like? It's like, uh... Kind of tastes like a sweet graham cracker, almost. Hmm. Eam but kind of like a nutty actually, taste to let it. Me... Just so people have something, I'm gonna I'm gonna move you around a little bit. Yeah, jump in and slash yeah, it. Go ahead and continue to to eat that. I'm just gonna move you <laughs> back to somewhere you needed to go anyway. All right. Cause we're going back this time. We're going back to find the bee village, and you never would have found this because it took me forever to find it. And also, you passed right by it and didn't even seem to notice it. So, it's one of the harder secrets in the game to find. I believe it was added in like an update of some kind. So. Oh, see, now that I'm tasting it more, you know what it is? It's that, it's, um, you know how those, like, assorted cookies that you get in, like, the, the those, like, holiday bot, like, uh, the big, like, holiday tins? It ta it's the, it's that cookie that nobody ever takes. <laughs> <laughs> because you just want the chocolate chip cookie. Oh, okay. But with it being covered in milk chocolate, it's actually not bad. It's actually pretty great. So, to those people that are making those tins, just coat... Those cookies in milk chocolate, and people will like them. <laughs> and they'll be good. Yeah, like I said, I was originally going to put them on the unboxings, but I've been doing the unboxing solo, and I don't really like to try new foods. So I'm really picky. So we're just going to, the next couple of legs plays, we're going to intersperse food reviews in with them. <laughs> You'll be trying these. We'll open up those bags of chips and stuff. Those for things are going to kill me. <laughs> for now, though, if you've noticed, we, we like right here, there were the two bees floating there. Yeah. Oh, well, hoity-toity. <laughs> yeah, there was actually a slight crack in the wall leading into this. And we'll let you, are you let's, gonna... Uh, let's one-handed walk. <laughs> we got this. You probably I can walk if, and if chomp. If need be, we could just pause until you're done eating your toffee cookie. I can walk and chomp. The I think I am Some kind of pleb. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck this thing. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's going to be a, you? it's going to be a little difficult for you to be doing this with toffee in one hand and, and the the controller with the other. Is that a living hive? Should I kill it fast? Yes, it is just going to be shitting out bees. Just shoot beams at it until it's dead. I know you don't like magic, but you're eating a cookie and it's <laughs> no fine. <laughs> okay, Joe. I know you're already doing a lot of editing, but we're going to take a third picture here so you can see how James is trying to fucking do this. <laughs> Or he's just like using his pinky on the thing, <laughs> just with it in it in his lap, just having a dandy old time. Welcome to to Hollow Knight Challenge Mode. It really Hollow is. Hollow Knight plus cookie. <laughs> Hollow Knight cookie mode. Let's go. Yeah. Suddenly these little bee enemies become really difficult. I was trying to uh, <laughs> I was trying to dash by using my knee, and <laughs> all I did was start up this. I was like, that's not, that's not that, what I wanted. That's not working very well. This is not doing the thing I want it to do. 
you may find the enemies in this next part of the hive a little more tricky to deal with. I mean, not this one, because it's just more of those bees. Oh, it's so hard. They just sort of mildly bumble their way over towards you. Get okay. it? Because okay. there's, there, there's a napkin right there. Just okay. take a napkin. A na I'll, I'll take a nappy. I'll take a nappy. There. There we go. <laughs> We're good. Challenge we'll mode over for later. <laughs> Challenge mode over for the moment. You got you got to give it to them. They 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 could have just like you know, they could have made a chest or they could have made some kind of just like, generic, uh, like geo station thing. And they they made separate ones for every area, even bonus areas like this. You want to go left. What's right? Telling you right now, right's where you're gonna go in a second, but you want to go left first. Is there a sleepy time? Just go left and stop asking questions. You don't want to ask questions. <laughs> what the fuck is that? A super bee. You can attack it while it's doing that. Just don't let it poke you. Oh, you let it poke you! Why'd you let it poke you? There you go. I didn't let it. It just did it on its own. Like, didn't even ask for my consent. Nothing. It just, it just began the poking. <laughs> okay. I'll bite. Yeah, come to me. Kachungus! Yes. <laughs> it's free! Real yeah, estate. and this is, even though it has its own name, it's technically just part of, uh, the whatchamacallit. Um, I would say just Grub Song. That's, that's always, oh no, you gotta put Steady Body on there. Yeah, you're good. There we go, I got, I got Longy Slashies, Super Fast Slashies, and Shadow Dash. And, uh, speedy dash slash. Speedy dash slash. Dash slash. Dash slash and boogie. Yeah, it's the, as we're recording this, the, these come out like several weeks later, but it's currently the 3rd of July. And, uh, there you go. I just enjoy that. <laughs> yep. Fuck you, bees. That's you. The more powerful your nail because that that's the thing I was confusing. I, I thought that the, the beam scaled with your nail damage, but it's this that scales with your nail damage. So if you upgrade, yeah, he explodes into bees. So watch out for that. <laughs> no, it's fine. <laughs> Just dash. Come here, guys. Come here. Come here for a second. Good job. Come here. Come here. Good job. Yeah. Oh. No, not you. Those, those. There. There you go. There you go. Good job. You could just shoot a beam through them all, too. What do I look them. like? Some kind of magic user? I mean, you're tech I mean, isn't your dash just a form of magic? No. <laughs> That's an ability. That takes skill. He's ghosting through them while slashing them. Hey, pressing B takes some skill. Yeah, like pressing a button, and sometimes pressing the button makes you have to... There you go. Good job. Quick! <laughs> Use quick slashes with your quick slash ability. Really? Yeah. Uh -huh. No, it's not Good re. Job. It's B. B. Okay, and you already got that over there. It's one of those one of Come those here. spook trees. That'll help. And this is probably the easiest spook tree in the game too. So, spook tree? Yeah, I forget what they're actually called. Dream tree? I don't know. Fuck. What do you think I am? Some sort of health goblin? Yes. I don't know what that is exactly, but yes. It's a goblin of health. I mean, I don't know what more you could want. Um, consistency. <laughs> You're not going to get that. I have the consistency of, like, stale, chunky peanut butter with random things thrown into it. <laughs> I mean, that's still a consistency. I mean, it's not a very attractive one. It has but... literally random things thrown into it. It's like the least consistent thing you could do. It's consistently, it's, uh, consistently random. You guys having fun up there? They're, they're, they're always having fun. They could turn into weird... It's weird that, like, the art style obviously is all drawn, but they're, like, the only enemy in the game I can think of that just straight up, like, transforms, like, some sort of Saturday morning cartoon, like, into a weapon. <laughs> <laughs> Which is very goofy. The hive was added later in develop. I believe it... Like I said, I believe it was DLC. I can't... I can't remember exactly. It wouldn't come to me, so I was like, well, die then. Well, just just die then, okay? If that's what you're I gonna do. I guess I'll just die then. <laughs> oh no! Oh no, it's a fat guy wearing a coat of bees. <laughs> hey, you got a free soul there. That happens from time to time. 
<laughs> just runs into it. And I'm like, <laughs> I'm mining here. God, I'm walking here. Did I get all the shiny sparkles? Or yeah. Did I miss one? You got them all. Are you sure? Yeah. There's not that many around here. You Is can that... go check the tree. It's like I don't, I don't remember like the big flash going off. You were in the middle of fighting stuff. Okay, so I guess I did. Yep. I said, this is one of the easiest ones. They're just sort of like in this room and nowhere else. It's like, oh, okay. Well, that was... That was easy. I don't have to do anything. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> you will believe a man can fly. Yeah, see, I, I went back. I started playing this game again. That's a big B. Okay. Bye. <laughs> don't let them hit you. What if that'll be bad? Go ahead, do it. D today. He waits or until he has a target and then he does it. Haha, <laughs> cheese. <laughs> Super cheese. My favorite kind of cheese is video game cheese. Uh oh. <laughs> Next. <laughs> oh, he got you. It's okay. I got him back. Nope. <laughs> Very close. Come here. Do it again. Do it again. Good boy. Good boy. It's a big. B Who's a good bee? He <laughs> is. Who's a dead boy? You <laughs> is. All right. So whose chairs? Can I sit I, in them? I don't know. Fine. Fuck him. <laughs> it's one of those things I would have thought Moss Bag would bring up, but he didn't. So whose chairs are these? sitting in there the huge bees the little bees the these huge don't, these don't seem to be the right size for anyone <laughs> oh he had a friend doing a hide we all have friends james we do yeah i have friends yeah oh damn hello <laughs> you gotta destroy it. there you go and you you've been here before if you look at your map i don't like my map yeah that's just another uh, another way to get into the hive. The little bees respawn at the drop of, of a hat. I prefer to think of it as another way to get the fuck out of here. Yeah. I mean, it's farther away from the bench. I like the bench myself. I'm kind of a bench lord. Would you say you press for those benches? A, a I bench do. press, if you will? I should have made that joke earlier when you, when you were doing work to get into the benches. Whatever, nerd, I'm out of here. Enjoy that. Oh, oh, well, that hurt. I told you not to let him hit you, and you let him hit you. I mean, letting hit and couldn't avoid said hit, two different things. Nope. <laughs> I gotta hand it to him, though, at least when it comes to that. They do double damage when they hit you, but if you run into them... It's just one damage. Lots of game developers would be really lazy with that. Again, gotta give it to Team Cherry. They do a lot of really cool cool stuff with this. Would you say that um, was the cherry on top of the programming? I can't tell if you're trying to hold back coughing. a laugh or cough. <laughs> I'm having issues. I'm ha it's fine. Lungs are stupid. Is, is it the toffee? Is the toffee making you coffee? No, I just have bad lungs. Okay. That's just the other entrance where you found that bug. Maybe if you I could... slash enough, I'll no. dig through. Oh, okay. No, stop. James. What was the po point in this room? Th there was money there. Are you sure? Yeah. That's it. Greed. Well, also there was the the whole idea that uh, what you call it, the um, you could see into there from there. Like that was I found that that little room with the bug in it, and I was like, wait, I can see more nest. How do I get in there? And I spent like an hour running around the the fallen kingdom, trying to find my way. Do it. Do it, coward. Okay. Uh, I think I started the I was like, it's January 3rd when we're recording this. For some reason, fire... Well, not for some reason, but fireworks are going... It's not January, it's July 3rd! <laughs> it's actually January, he's <laughs> lying. He's just trying to explain away the bombs. It's January 3rd, so I'm really confused about why there are fireworks going off. It's actually January okay, keep, of uh, keep up 2023. To the keep up to the top. World War Three is going on right now. <laughs> Yeah, there, there are explosions no, 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 no. outside, people setting off early fireworks. Quickly slash, with your quick slash. There we go. Okay, so now, like, climb up the wall. How about I heal first, and then I climb the wall? 
and then do a crystal dash. And then stop on your right foot. Don't forget it. Oh, oh you almost you for, had it. You made me... F I can't forget something if I didn't know it was coming up. <laughs> this, is a spon this is a Spongebob meme. Comment in the comments if you liked Spongebob as a kid. I, I, hmm. I went on it, and then he didn't grab it. <laughs> it ain't easy. This is one of the hardest things to find, which is why I'm having you do it here. Because most people won't I'll just find just dash that. into yeah, the wall. There we go. <laughs> That's what you need to do sometimes. Dash to break. <laughs> Gooey. Goo. Oh, hey. Oh, hi, Raul. I'm slowly learning to trust the babies again. Which I know right the second in... that I do, the last one I find is going to be like a freaking psychopath. And just yeah. go, blah, 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 blah. You're going to enter a room and there will be like four babies in them and they're all going to be evil. You'd be like, no, why have you betrayed me? My tiny trust. Ooh, you didn't time that one right. I was trying to dash, but it came way faster than that I thought it work. would. Okay, so before, go to the left a little bit. Nope. Ooh. Otherwise, you're going to make this thing impassable, and you don't want to do that. Not impassable, but you'll, you'll have to, like, leave and come back, and it'll suck. So I'm going to the right. Left. Right. So, see there with the mass shard and the wall's kind of like cracky, but you can't break it? Yeah. You need to lure one of those big guys over and get him to crash into the wall. I've seen this movie. <laughs> also a Dark Souls thing. Is it? Is there a wall that you have to get a big guy to crush into? Yeah, if you want to get, um, what's his name? Hey, he hit the wall. That's not that guy. The big guy. The Oh, the big one. Yeah. Okay. The ones that can destroy the walls. I didn't know they could destroy walls, but... There you go. And now you're safe. <laughs> and now you got another health! Congratulations! Another healy. Hell yeah, Batman. Full health, Hell too. Hell yeah. Don't go through that. It'll reset the... Well, I guess it doesn't matter. You haven't killed anything in this room. What's in here? Shortcuts and depression? Yep. Got it. Just a shortcut. <laughs> and depression. I mean, it's a shortcut to getting depression, if that's what you want. Whee! Oh. Aww. <laughs> At least you ran into the little one and not the big one. Let me in, please. <laughs> Let me in. Let me in! <laughs> <laughs> the panic swipes. <laughs> Why are there so many pillars? It's called honey. Someone has to make the honeycomb. It's not small. Nope. Big B! Where's the bench? Biggest B! The the closest one was the one you used. Fuck. Alright, let's go die fine. once. See how fun that is. It's fine. B night's not that difficult. Can it be benign and just stand there? Uh, that one will, yeah. That thing's dead. Oh, is it? Yeah. Okay, so where's the real boss? There he is! Oh, I'm sorry, the Hive Knight. He's really easy if you've got the teleport dash. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay, I don't like that. <laughs> yeah, watch out for those. Zoop! <laughs> Huzzah! Oh, okay. New places. Yeah, they come up in random places. Yeah, it's not recommended getting on top of him. Quick what if heal. I like? What if I like to be on top of him? You know, some people do like it on top. <laughs> that, <laughs> that was weird. He seems like one that I could just spam at a lot. Remember uh, how you said the bee boss would uh, shoot the little bees at him? Yeah, I'm seeing that. Good thing he just let me stand there and heal. Yep. The bees aren't that good at their job. Oh, I thought it was going to go left to right. It didn't. <laughs> I barf bees! There's like another moss bag thing where he points out, like, if you go frame by frame and look at it, he barfs up nine bees, but somehow 14 bees come down. <laughs> okay, this is problematic. You're getting cocky. Oh, uh, he rolled. Yeah. 
You were doing so good before, and then you're like, I'll just swipe at him a whole bunch instead of calculatedly dodging through him. I can't do the dodging anymore when he's got 20 bees flying at me, too. <laughs> well, then you just attack the bees. Oh, that's dumb. I can't one-shot him. There'd be no point. One shot, one opportunity. Excuse you? <laughs> Bouncy little bastard. I'm gonna take it out on you because you look the same. I'm bad about profiling. I'm styling and profiling, but not in the way that most people like that kind of thing. Okay, you little shits are gonna need to stop that. Especially you. You're gonna, you're gonna, you're about to lose all your money, son. Well, I look like some kind of plebeian. I want to heal up. Well, you got a chance. It was all calculated. It's fine. Is this really the far that like th this far away is the closest bench? Yep. This boss isn't that hard, so they had to make you do a really salty run back. Well, doing a great job, bastards. <laughs> Be bastards. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> Oh, just go against the right wall. What was the right wall? That was the, the, the uh, secret thing that you put. The yeah. entrance. I was like, what is this, a shortcut? I was like, yeah, this is a shortcut to yeah, this Yeah, but room. it's where Depression was, right? Yeah, I don't remember Depression. <laughs> I thought you were really good at, at repressing. Oh, yeah, never mind. <laughs> <laughs> you repre you, you're sitting there repre repressing your Depression. Nah, it's fine. You can go with this at like fourth of your life. Who needs who needs health for this fight? Just, just salty run through everything. Yeah, it's fine. <laughs> plop, plop, and fill it back up, and plop. That's fine. You used to remember when you used to only have four healths? Yeah, those were the good days. Come here. I ain't fighting you over there. Parry myself like a fucking champ. <laughs> Parry knight. Yeah, 4,000 things back. I am the Eggman. <laughs> oh, I turned into him. <laughs> nope. <laughs> Zoop! Oh. I find nine times out of ten when he does that little, like, make all the spikes, you can just sort of, like, go to the corner and heal. I mean, only for, like, one. And remember, you can dash towards him now. It'll, in fact, it'll hurt him. In fact, you have a charm specifically to do that. <laughs> Zupa Zazz! You said I could go to the corner! I said most of the time! I feel betrayed. Now I just feel grossed out. I feel grossed out by his bee mouth that doesn't make any sense. <laughs> <laughs> what about here? Am I safe here? Cool. Yeah. You were safe there. I love when he does that, because then I can just be like, nah, nah. Don't. Don't. I said don't! <laughs> I asked! A very specific question, and you did not heed my answer. Okay, there's only one that time. I think you can hit them as they're coming up, it's just... Oh, hello! <laughs> <laughs> the tiny bees! Yeah, fuck off. Fuck off, tiny bees! I don't want to have to deal with you! Okay, that was just confusing. Hitboxes. Zoop! <laughs> The haunting hive night theme. Da 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 da. Nope. Zoop you. <laughs> oh yeah, but see when you do that, I can just. Nope. Hey, it did it. There's don't die to the tiny bees now. I was about to. <laughs> there was like one more, and I was like, no, 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 no. My queen, I have. <sighs> All right, now we dream now. No. <laughs> Uh, go ahead. I'm not sure if he has anything. How far away? Nope. 
<laughs> He's here. too recent. He doesn't have any death thoughts yet. You gotta give him a moment. Hmm, spikes. Giant bee butt. <laughs> Your ass is huge, lady. Hive blood. Have you considered Jazzercise? So, the hive blood charm, uh, another one that like a lot of people really like, especially late game. Is it a summony one? No. Haha, <laughs> no. <laughs> Story? Nah, dog. Fuck it. He's some kind of bee. Who cares? <laughs> it's nothing really important. My knight, at last you're free. Small thing, I know your kind. If you attempt to resolve your past, then know I am not the queen you seek. It is the pale being that bears blame for your nature. Though this hive exists within Hollow Nest, we play no part in its attempted perpetuation. Go ahead and use your dream nail on her. It's a free one, one. <laughs> huh. Yeah, pretty much all the ghosts that, like, you talk to, you can dream nail them and get one essence. But yes, the Hive Blood charm, what it does is it turns all your, 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 uh, your masks into honeycombs. And the, the last honeycomb that's been damaged will heal itself over time. Huh. So you slowly regenerate health. The thing is, like, okay, so say you, you have full health and you take two damage. Only the last one will heal, and then once that's healed, you won't heal anymore. But it's one of those things, like, if you just take one hit at a time, you can just ignore it and walk around. A lot of people really like it for the, um... Whatchamacallit? For the Colosseum of Fools. Get me out of here. <laughs> I'm done with this shit. <laughs> Fucking hate bees. <laughs> Uh, don't worry, you're done with bees forever. It's literally the only reason. We just need to get that one charm, because you gotta get all the charms at one point. It Otherwise, was, it you'll was never the least get... charming charm I've ever charmed in my charming life. Yeah, well, also, you had to get bugs. Not bugs, grubs. Grubbies. Grubs are bugs. <laughs> grub bugs. Grub bug. We're going to grub bug. We got to grub a bug, and then we'll bug up a grub, and then we'll grub up ourselves for another big shot of goo. Nice. Nice. Sweet dodge, bro. Now to get out of dodge, you know <laughs> what I'm saying? Uh, but yes, so go ahead and go go up to the, the, the Fallen Kingdom. Up and to the right. Hello, Moo Cows. I like you because you're like the big bees, except for you don't actually do anything. You're just a free depository of soul for me to absorb. Nom, 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 I'm nom, the nom, Shang Tsung of bugs, just running around absorbing soul. It's like, bees, you are not in the right place. Your nest is somewhere else. Your nest is in a different castle. How did you get locked out? Nope, not there. That'll you take set you, up. I'll take you back to the royal waterways. What if I like the waterways? Full I mean, of if, cancer if and death. If you want to go there and try to fight the Gruz Mother again. Oh. Yeah, if you open up your map... Uh, City of Tears, that's where you want to go. But there's crying. There is? Oh, because it's the city. Ha ha. Ha ha ha, James! You're very funny! You're the funniest man! Mr. <laughs> Jokey, how come you don't got a YouTube channel? You're so funny. Um, maintenance. You do, it's, it's listed over on the side. You just don't do anything funny on it for some reason. No, I put up bad videos of myself being bad at Overwatch. Yeah. <laughs> I don't understand with with your com with your comedic genius and your ability to be funny, and your your ability to do comedy, you could have all sorts of. That's where you get the map if you uh. found it. Once you get all three seals, all the maps just become available in the main town, which is where you bought most of them, so you don't have to worry about it anymore. At you. <laughs> Ow! Why why did you do that? That was mean. Re. Yep, that's the Tower of Love. You still don't have the key for that. Yeah, Where so am I? You're right there. Where am I going? Right there. That's so far away. <laughs> yeah, but you can, like, you can like crystal dash through most of that. I got stuck in the water. I blame that. Oops. We're going to go get you another nail upgrade so you do more damage. And then we're going to take you to the Queen's Gardens. Free! 
It'll be a fun and dandy time. I don't believe you. I think it'll be an unfun but slightly dandy time. Yep. You, you, could, you could crystal dash through so much. I could, but I know you want me to, and not doing it makes you upset. Okay. <laughs> Plus, I can't crystal dash through that. Nope. I can land on his head and and hurt. And not downward slash for some reason. They, what happened? I feel like someone just went through me. This is like, oh, go up. Don't go down there. That's bad. Why? There you go. What was up there? Down there. That's that's back down to the uh, the abyss where you were at before. Eggman! Ah, oh, nice. You've killed enough of them to unlock the Super Hunter journal about him. It's your favorite enemies. I'm just gonna start calling them Pops. <laughs> what are we doing here? Is this funny jokes? Oh, hey, look, it's the Hollow Knight. Where? I don't see him. He's nothing. You can inspect. Oh. <laughs> he was so special. He was, he was at one arm, and he got the infection in him, so we didn't have to. But then he tried his best, but he still leaked. He's like a leaky diaper. That's not an analogy I enjoyed. Okay, so what you want to do is jump up on the wall next to you. This one? Yeah. Now Crystal Dash. Don't go that high. Just this like high. right there, yeah. That'll Three. save you a lot of time. Ow. Forehead. There we go. I think you could do the same thing here. You think? Yeah. Now I can. Now without the rebird's cousin. <laughs> oh, 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 oh! Perfect timing, young lad. You've done the things that do the things. Am I talking to this dude? Miss Cleo, yeah. Uh, ah, you've returned. I see you have some pale ore, a rare find. Give me some ore in a geo, and I'll make a cherry forge your nail. Two pale ore? Yep. It may Do cost it. more geo than you need, but it's fine. As you wish, I'll get to work then. Do so it. That costs two, for, so for the last one you need three, I'm guessing. Shink. Rocco's sleeping in the chair over here, and he heard that, and he's like, Hmm? What? The reforging is complete. It's a spiral form. Very tricky task. You'll find it stronger than ever before. Cut your way forward. Yeah, go ahead, go ahead and look at it on the thing now. See, it's got this neat, like, swirly pattern, so it's, like, geometric, and it stabs better. Don't ask me how, it just does. <laughs> I thought we were just going off of, like, you know, Gurren Logan's logic. Like, the more spiral power you have, the more powerful you become. <laughs> row, row, fight the power. Get the thing of the hour. This is the nail that will pierce the heavens! Yep. Now you can just and... crystal your way. Now I'll just go back the way you came. But it's so far away. Now that you're here, so far away, and I'm stronger than I get the day. What's up here? Uh, this is the way you got here originally. What's over here? Um, that. Pain and suffering. Yeah, pretty much. Things to fight mostly. Stuff to slow you down. I like two-shotting those yeah. guys. That's nice. <laughs> that, they, they, I, I, I like, like another thing. I guess you can get more money while you're here. If you want to go up and go up. I think you have some things to give to Relic Seeker Lem. Where'd he be? Uh, literally, take off your map. Hit that elevator that you're standing on. <laughs> Are you sure? Yeah. Oh, no, that's, that's complicated. I don't know if I There's can do that. There's a sign right there. It's shaped kind of like his head a little bit. Oh, yeah, you've got so many things. Arcane Egg. It seems like a simple egg, but it's not. A precious re relic from before the birth of Hollow Nest. More time. Voice acting. An arcane egg. Eh? Now this is a p uh, ancient thing. These relics are the prize of my profession. There's knowledge hidden within them, though it's very difficult, painstaking work to extract. One large undertaking can be gleaned, though. The civilization may claim itself the first. But something else did exist within this place before Hollow Nest. Each egg offers a narrow glimpse into that forgotten age. Whatever was before the king's idol. 
and they kind of go down like the king obviously that's from when the, the the nest was in its prime and then the arcane eggs are before then another king's idol have you visited the remains of the palace it's down below the city in the bedrock of the kingdom must have been an impressions impressive sight in its time now there's nothing left it's strange thing though there are no signs of conflict around the area it's as though the whole place just vanished and then the hollow nest seals from when the city was like going, but the god was already gone. And then the the director thing, yeah. I think he's just like at this point, he's like, yeah, those are cool, whatever, man. He's just like, neato, friend, have money. You're a talented collector. Keep worrying, and I'll run out of stuff. Oh hey, Wonders Journal. They wrote on a rock. Have you heard the saying about stone journals? If danger looks close by and your nail is dulled by wear, just swing your journal at your foes with blunt and deadly flare. It's a good one, ain't it? And accurate. They sure have a heft to them. Yep. Good thing about stone journals. Also, can be used to whack people. Get around to deciphering them at some point. Sell me things. How many of these must have traveled the breadth of the kingdom to accrue such a haul? And then that one. You're a talented collector. I'll run out of space. Okay, you don't have any relics? Okay, get the fuck out of here. We don't need that shit. Yeah? Or nah? Yeah, no. Nah? Nah. Nah! Just go back. Go back to the, the stag station. We Hi, Hollow Knight. Ow. Pops is like, what in the devil was that? <laughs> <laughs> Some fellow came rocketing in full of crystals. Probably that crystal meth I've heard so much about. <laughs> <laughs> just just keep going to the right. Just all the way back to where the, the guy was. The, uh, the bench and everything. Comment in the comments if you're you're a fan of crystal meth. I am personally not really big in it to it. James? Ed, no. <laughs> Why would you even ask that? Uh, just to be safe, you know. <laughs> I, I don't like want to offend, any, I like I don't want to you, offend any meth users. <laughs> I like how you would have just like immediately gone over him, but instead you decided to stop and land on his pointy head. I saw a thing and so I stopped. I didn't realize the stop was there. <laughs> I was like, Oops. object stop. Yeah, there's like a bunch. Where am I going? Up. I'm yeah. going down in the up. Oh, he's going down in the down. Yep. Goodbye. He's dead. He can't swim. I can't swim. What is he, a pleb? I can swim in acid. That's like ten times better than swimming. Okay, go ahead and rest. And then where you want to go is Queen's Station. Yas, Queen. Or actually, maybe Green Path. Now that I'm thinking about it. Now that I'm thinking that about I, it. Now that I recall, I'm wrong. Now that I'm thinking about it, I'm completely wrong. Just sit on the bench anyway. Why not? <laughs> Let's go to Green Path. I think the Nail Master Can that we you haven't it? been to is here. Can we rename it the Orange Path? <laughs> uh, no. No, you Ding -ding. cannot. Okay, look at your map real quick. Where the hell have you been here? Okay, there. See that big, like, long thing that, like, just fades into the void? I love the void. You're we were just there. there. No, we we're, were in the abyss. It's yeah, like the void. The abyss is like the void, but with fundamental differences. The, Mainly, it's not... Did you not say the abyss? The abyss. The abyss. The abyss. Vis a vis. Uh, Goodbye. <laughs> Goodbye. I created the Matrix. Vis a vis. Uh, <laughs> vis a vis. Shopping is fun! <laughs> nope. I forget who did that. It was a old Newgrounds animation when the Matrix came out. They were making fun of that whole architect scene. Where they're like, Neo gets to where the architect is and he turns his chair around. And it's literally just like a little stuffed doll with like a thing that you pull. Yes. Like a little, little pull toy. And he's just like, what's going on here? And he pulls the little thing and it's like... I created the Matrix! <laughs> He's like, ah. pulls the thing. The problem is choice! Vis-a-vis! Vis-a-vis! -vis. God damn it. 
Shopping is fun! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I hope you're ready for more downward slashy things. Oh, wait. Eh! Oh. <laughs> so close. You're so close, and yet so far. You can bounce off the backs of those guys. It. Yeah, but... Dashing. <laughs> but I'm a dashing gentleman! Look how dashing I am. I glow when I do it. Yeah, I mean, you don't have to bounce off that guy, but bouncing off that guy would really help. Fine. Because it resets your double jump. God, I and hate it, that. It resets your double jump and your dash. When, whenever you, like, hit something, whether it's a person or not. No, I'll just do it. I'll just do it the old-fashioned way. <clears throat> Whee! Good luck. I think that's the way you're intended to do it this time. <laughs> okay, I got I got this. I got this. Just dash now. Nope. Now. <laughs> yeah, see I did it. No no faults at all. <laughs> yeah. Fuck, I hate these. Oh my god. You don't yeah, don't try to dash on it. You can jump after you hit him. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I figured it out a little late, but it's fine. I'll die. <laughs> oh, oh, he went down heart. right when I swung. Like a dick. He went down when I tried to go up. He went up when I tried to go down. He got chocolate in my peanut butter, if you know what I mean. <laughs> That's a good... Oh. That's a you good might want to kill some things so you have like enough soul to heal when you get down there. What? So don't, you don't, don't lose give me seven, logic. I don't want that shit. Seven thousand dollars. That's a lot of money to lose. I do that again. Good boy. <laughs> I'm only getting like one though because I one shot everything. Yeah, but that's why you could just run through and like whack, whack, whack. Just like whacking off. <laughs> I I don't think it's anything like that. I mean, I don't know about you, but whenever but whenever I do that, it doesn't kill things. <laughs> I <also> hope not. <laughs> I hope not. I don't actually know, truth be told. You cannot get up there. Are you, what if I, like, super concentrated all of my bulk into my legs? What if I really concentrated? Yeah, that's just some lore. Ugh, lore and story? Ugh. Story lore? Stalore. Sylvester Stalore. Is there, like, any enemies over here? Nope. That's why I was telling you to kill them while you were going down. <laughs> I did! <laughs> I did, after I passed, like, six And then six I dashed into the rose petals of death. The thorns of regret. <laughs> we'll just have to try. I mean, if need be, I can Orenstein and Smow this for you and just sort of do it. Uh, no. <laughs> Uh, no. My pride is in order here. God damn it. I hate those spikes being like on the edge. I'm on the edge of spikes. Why didn't I just do that to begin with? What? God, the hitbox on that is so stupid. Yeah, the problem is if you get like halfway through and then die. Fucking... I just go back to the bench now because if you if you get halfway through and then die, then you're gonna be on that part with like two health and be unable to get back. It'll either. just motivate me to do it better. <laughs> oh what? Nope, that was the wrong button. <laughs> Oops. Hey, you did it. Now, where's the me? It's all the way over there. Yep. Come here. Don't you do it. I knew you were going to do it. Now get over <laughs> here. Take your medicine, me. Oh, I forgot. I'm stronger now. I take four hits. Yep. Okay. I can see where this is going. I have to get up there eventually, don't I? Nope. I don't. Why are they floating there? You're good. 
I think you were supposed to dash between them with the crystal dash, but what you did is good too. A lot simpler. Don't go after it. You don't no. need it. <laughs> Nobody needs it. Can I sell those? Uh, no. Okay, I see how this works. Except I'm scared of the spikes. Hey, a bench! An altar! Da -da 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 An altar to rest my ass! Do -da 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 oh, hey. Bob Ross, is that you? <laughs> it's Bug Ross! Bug Ross, he's, I'm your biggest fan. I'm a painting man. I'm a painting man. A visitor, what? I don't know what Bob Ross, I don't know how to do an impression. I just gotta like, start, like talk really soft. A visitor? Why have you crept in here, little grub? Perhaps like me, you have a taste for discovering new things? I'm Shio, and in a previous life, I was a nail master. Yes, the only thing that drove me was becoming stronger and honing my skills with a nail. I imagined it was my one true calling in life, but that feeling faded over time. Now I seek a new calling, something that speaks to my soul and compels me forward. That's why I spend my time here, secluded, trying to master the art of creation. Painting, sculpting, these things bring a different kind of pleasure. You don't see be you you don't seem very moved by what I said. Was it Shio the nail master you were looking for? Did you come here to learn a nail art? I'll teach you if you insist. Yes, Bob, teach me your ways. <laughs> it's fine. <laughs> Let me show you. Watcha The slash of a paintbrush is the same as the slash of a sword. Great <laughs> slash. Hold X. Yeah, they're, they're all the same. It's just depending on what direction you face. This is probably the most useful, though, to a lot of people. My work, does it move you? The wielding of a nail, the wielding of a brush, these things are not so different. We cut into the world so we can peer deeper inside. <laughs> For now, though, I have nothing more to teach you. Your path forwards, only you can see it. Good luck. And God bless. And God bless. <laughs> Thanks, Wait, what was the what was the bug god name? Uh, a pale king. <laughs> and pale pale king bliss. Pa pale bliss. <laughs> a pale blessing upon you. Yeah, just go go to. Yep. See, that's if you press up this time. Just release it regular. No, regular was the spin before. Oh, uh, yep. Yeah, you have to press up to do that. They changed it. And then if you dash and do it, you can do like a, a slash dash. Which has super long range, but not very useful. But the thing about that, especially if you're, again, if you're trying to do, like, the Trial of the Fool or something, it's while you're, uh... While you're you're waiting for, like, the things to spawn, you charge that up and you can kill Primal Aspids in one hit. <laughs> I love how a lot of your strats are completely based around how to kill Primal Aspids Th fast. These are not my strats. These are strats that I've read about. Yeah, but they're the ones you centered on. Everyone hates Primal Aspids. It's just the ones you specifically centered on. These things have a name. I don't know what they are, because they're not primal aspids. <laughs> primal aspids, I know what they are. Luckily, what about that one? You don't have to go all the way back through it. I have no idea. Is that a is that a is that a fatty armory primal aspid? <laughs> no idea. Fatarmory? And there you go. Congratulations. Now, real quick, before the episode ends, just go back up to the uh the, the bench. The bench and the guy. We're gonna go back. Go back to, uh... You already killed everything here in one hit. <laughs> yeah, now I want to kill it with vengeance. Yeah, now I want to kill it with a huge... Ka-chow! I like it because it's like the opposite sound of like when you get hit by someone and you take double damage. It's like a slightly pitched <laughs> version of that. It's sort of like saying, yeah, you know how those guys hit you and it's like... Doosh! Now you do that. <laughs> <laughs> Congratulations. Congratulations. There's also, what was it? Uh, that That's how people beat the, uh, with all the bindings on. There's a thing that's like, you have to beat the, the boss rush mode with all your nail upgrades gone. But the great slash is based off whatever the highest nail you have is, even if all the things are, even if all the bindings are on. Uh, go, yeah, back to Dirt Mouth. So all the, uh... So when they're, like, fighting the bosses with that, you use nothing but great slashes, because then you can take them down a lot easier. 
Hey. Okay, so you remember that guy who sold you all the things? The... The little hopping on to you? <laughs> yeah. I think he was right there. No, he was to the, the to the left. You were right in front of it. There you go. Well, he said right there when I was standing over there, and... Oh. Descend. Into madness. I don't know, last time I went in somebody's basement, I, I saw some things, man. <laughs> Some stuff, man, and some things. I wouldn't recommend it. I started just brisk walking. What's this? <laughs> what big, you looking at, buddy? Big nail. What you looking at, huh? Can I can I have you this? You could talk to him. Nah, talking. You, you couldn't lift that nail. Sure I could. Let me, let me just... Eh. <laughs> let me just... Eh. So, another one join our group. I have a gift for you, warrior. As a shopkeeper, I admit parting with it for free is rather difficult. But as a great nail sage, I must recognize your skills. You have mastered the arts of my remaining pupils. Now tradition decrees you too may hold the symbol. Bama. Wear it proudly, nail master. You shall be the last to receive its like. Now bow to your sensei. Bow to your sensei. Bow what? to your sensei. Bow to your sensei. <laughs> yeah. There we go. Good job. <laughs> But yes, that's a charm. Uh, so if you charge up to use any of the charge attacks, you can now do it twice as fast. So you charge, and it's a one notch. Give me that. So shit for a lot of people, <laughs> yeah. But yeah, that's the thing. When you find him, he's down in the ruins, and he's got like kind of orange in his eyes, and he's sort of babbling nonsense because he was kind of being infected, and you like wake him up from it. But it, when he says like Oro, you hold your nail like an oaf. <laughs> Or you Oy. hold your nail like a paintbrush or something like that. Which is a hinting like, oh, he taught the three guys that you learned the three things from. And in the boss rush mode, where you fight the whole pantheon, you can fight him in his prime. And he is fucking insane. <laughs> and he uses that huge nail. It's but really now, cool. Now what do I what do I get rid of? That's oh. the problem. Do you really use the shadow slash? But going through things. <laughs> but you could smell bad and attack faster. I mean, you could just save that for, like, when you have a, uh... Whatchamacallit? No, I'll just smell bad and slash fast. Yeah. Making up for the fact that my nail is shorter. There's that thing. Oh, you went for the shorter nail? Interesting. Well, if I gave... I'd have to give up one of these. Yeah. Or you could just wait and use it for, like, bosses and stuff, but... Yeah, nah... <laughs> and that's the thing is like I feel like the, the 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 nail sage's mastery is best used against the normal enemies because while you're walking you can just charge it up and then just one shot things. That's way faster. Yeah, it's super fast. Precept five: strength beats strength. Is your opponent strong? No matter. Simply overcome their strength with even more strength, and soon they'll be defeated. Dude. So there you go. There's another That's, episode of Hollow Knight. I'm just, th th I'm just, I'm just gonna stand here and let him just suffocate <laughs> on the, on the stink. It, you, you, I, oh wait, I can get rid of him. He's not even in the game. Watch, guys, gone, gone. It's no, me. No one has to, there is no Zote. I'm magnificent. Me. <laughs> He's just that stink that's always behind me. If you catch my drift. Ha 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 ha. Let's see. Up for one more episode tonight, James. Well, you said two, but if we can do three... I'll go I three. can do three, my headache is gone. Sweet. Okay, one more episode. Next time on Legs Play, The Queen's Garden. Comments in the comments, if you comment in the comments. Comments in the comments, if you comment in the comments. If you like these guys, please subscribe.